Hi, I'm Phil. Welcome to Holy Habitus, and today we're back in the One Year Bible Reading Plan, April the 11th, Luke 14, verse 7 and following, which says this. When Jesus noticed that all who had come to the dinner were trying to sit in the seats of honour near the head of the table, he gave them this advice. When you're invited to a wedding feast, don't sit in the seat of honour. What if someone who is more distinguished than you has also been invited? The host will come and say, give this person your seat. Then you'll be embarrassed and you'll have to take whatever seat is left at the foot of the table. Instead, take the lowest place at the foot of the table. Then, when your host sees you, he will come and say, Friend, we have a better place for you. Then you'll be honoured in front of all the other guests. For those who exalt themselves will be humbled, and those who humble themselves will be exalted. Ah, oh, it's a great little story here, an encounter between Jesus and some people who are scrambling for the seats of honour. Uh, and Jesus gives them a piece of practical advice presumably from his seat at the lowest point at the table. As a practical piece of advice to help them save face uh, and not be embarrassed in social situations. But actually, as we read, we realise that this is a kingdom principle that Jesus is trying to teach them. It resonates with the God uh, that we find in Scripture, who we're told time and time again, raises up the lowly but humbles the proud. And Jesus says, this is the way of life, the way of humility that my disciples must follow. He himself exemplified this. We read in Philippians 2 how, how Jesus could have had the seat of honour, but chose instead to humble himself, become like a servant, become a human being, humbled himself to the point of death, even death on a cross. And as a result, therefore, God has raised him, exalted him to the highest seat and given the name that is above all other names. And so we see that played out in, God's, in, in Christ's life. And so we, as, as disciples of Jesus, want to pick up our cross and take the lowest seat to intentionally in life choose the lowest seat at the table of life to honour and exalt others above ourselves to choose to give them the preferential treatment I choose the way of humility to have the starting assumption that maybe we aren't always right maybe we aren't the best or the most superior maybe others are better than ourselves when we do that um, we leave our self-exaltation self-promotion all of that and we place our vindication in the hands of our host, God, our Father in heaven. So this week, have a think about how in your interactions, your social encounters, you might prefer the needs of others. You might take the lowest seat, leaving the initiative for your exaltation in the hands of God where it firmly belongs.